Hey everyone, this is Tony Teaches Tech. I'm Tony, and in this video, I'm gonna show you at least 10 different ways to host a 100% completely free website. Some of these options have certain limitations while others are more customizable, but the goal by the end of this video is to help you determine which option is best for your website. So let's go ahead and get right on into it. All right guys, right off the bat here, we will be looking at the following 11 different options for hosting a free website. And that includes the Google Cloud Platform, Blogger, Google My Business, Google Sites, Infinity Free, WordPress.com, 000 Web Host, Wix, Weebly, Pard, and GitHub Pages. Like I said, these free website options can be quite different from each other. So to help guide your decision, I ranked each option in the categories of customizability, technical difficulty, hosting limitations, whether or not you can make a blog, and finally, if there is unremovable branding. So let's look at each one of these categories and we will start with customizability. As you can see here, Google Sites, Google My Business, and Card are some of the least customizable options, whereas you'll have the most flexibility with your website design when using Wix, GitHub Pages, and the Google Cloud Platform. Now, if you're looking for just a basic landing page or a simple one-page website for your business, then honestly, any of these options will work for you. But if you want multiple pages with a specific layout and color scheme, then I would take that into consideration. Next up, you'll definitely notice a correlation between customizability and difficulty because you'll see that Google Sites, Google My Business, and Card are predictably among the most beginner-friendly ways to host a free website, but you'll also notice that Blogger and Wix made the cut for being beginner-friendly as well. The two most technically difficult free web hosting options to work with that require a solid understanding of HTML and web development are the Google Cloud Platform and GitHub Pages. And I just wanna make you all aware that I do have step-by-step -step tutorials for each one of these web hosting options, which I will link in a playlist at the end of this video. So if you are willing to learn some of these technologies, then I am here to help. Now they say nothing in life is truly free and that is somewhat the case for about half of these websites. These options here have some sort of monthly bandwidth limitation, storage limitation, or prevent you from accessing all of their premium features without paying while the other options are genuinely 100% free without any restrictions whatsoever. Next, what's interesting is which one of these options place a watermark or some sort of branding on all of your pages. With these five options here, you can safely host your website on their platform for free and your visitors won't know the difference, whereas these options here embed an unremovable link and or logo on your website in exchange for using their free hosting. And here's an example of what these branding watermarks look like. If you're interested in writing blog posts on your free website, you can do that on any of the options except for Google My Business, Google Sites, GitHub Pages, and Card, as these hosting platforms do not offer blogging functionality. With that overview out of the way, here is a table that summarizes everything we talked about. So for example, if you consider yourself a beginner but you want complete control over the layout of your website, then Wix might be the right choice for you. However, if you don't want Wix branding to show up on your site, then Weebly is going to be your best choice. On the other hand, if you're looking for blogging functionality without any limitations whatsoever, then blogger.com will be your best bet. If you need a little bit more time to study this chart, then I'll have it linked down in the description below. And like I said, if you are looking for a step-by-step -step tutorial for one of these free website hosting options, then you can find that in this playlist right here. I wanna thank you guys for watching this video. Subscribe for more videos like this from me in the future. And if you do, I'll see you in the next one.